Today I'm going to take you on a tour of downtown Toronto. Let's hop onto the train that's going to take us straight into the heart of Canada's commercial and cultural capital, Toronto. That's the Union Station, the major nerve center of all railway transportation in Canada. We have trains uh, running across Canada and across the border to the United States. And that's the CN Tower in the background. And that's me right outside, uh, right outside Canada's biggest train station, the Union Station. This is Toronto's financial district called Bay Street the Canadian equivalent of Wall Street south of the border, home to major banks, corporate law firms and important Canadian institutions. So here I am, downtown Toronto at the Nathan Phillips Square. It's one of the biggest landmark in, uh, right in the middle of Toronto and venue for many cultural events. You can see the big large Toronto sign in the background. I don't know if you can. Yeah, you can. So it's like a, a landmark, very popular among tourists and locals. Lots of people come here, especially during, uh, during the summer season. They come here to hang out. Lots of restaurants around. Colossal structures, and you can see behind me my old mate from Dubai, Danish. Hello. <laughs> so that's Nathan Phillips Square. The whole place turns into a, a massive giant ice rink in the winter season when it gets really, really cold and everything is around you is frozen. It turns into a large ice skating rink. Let's get a little bit closer and see uh, what this place is all about.
center into a yet another dark, dodgy <laughs> back alley of Toronto, where you get to see all these uh, interesting Hollywood style back ladders, I don't know what you call them. <laughs> these stairs, on which you've seen many uh, baddies escape <laughs> the law enforcement officers. <laughs> street corner. Let's walk up to him and find out what he's selling us today. Hey man, you want to buy some of my yeah. hair sweat? You want to buy some hair sweat? Is it going to give me a nice buzz? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You just lick it right off, man. Just lick yeah. it right off. Yeah, please don't stop me. Stop, oh no, stop. Where are you going? Stop, come here, come back. <laughs> Now entering Chinatown, a little cultural silo tucked away within the belly of downtown Toronto. The place is lined with vibrant storefronts and sidewalks selling Chinese food, art, clothing, and other cultural symbols. Cafe. Featuring the Bitches Brew Cocktail. Like Poets Paradise. That's a really cool looking bar though. Poetry and Pints. Cool. Rhythm and Juice. <laughs> juice, yes. <laughs> no. myself in the same thing <laughs> for a split second <laughs> then can you miss it <laughs> it's like a it's like a vampire it is this is queen's key a prominent street in the harbourfront neighborhood of toronto right at the edge of downtown the gateway to toronto's second international airport the billy bishop airport located on Toronto Island. By far the best shot of Sea Tower, Toronto's most prominent landmark. You can also see the large dome of Toronto's biggest baseball park, the Rogers Centre. Also visible in the background are two monstrosities, the BMO and RBC Towers major Toronto landmarks.
Finally, a long and exciting day in downtown Toronto comes to an end. Uh, hope you like it and hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed wandering around. And that's a wrap. Take care. Bye.